Alrighty, we are back. Uh, we are also Carlos. I'm sorry, I said that weird. We are also Carlos. <laughs> and Jill is also dying. Yeah, we should probably do something about that. So we need the... I don't know, something? We need some... Whoa, he looked a bit goofy there. Wait, hold on. No, I... What? No, he looks fine. Okay, I was gonna say, he looked at... Jill, I... Okay. So we're just gonna leave her die in there. Um... We have health in there, but I've already got two of them, so I don't need. I also apparently don't need this, and also apparently... There's an item in here. Where? Probably by the door. Yes! <laughs> cool! Okay, so now we've got Carlos's gear. We need to go find the vaccine for her. I believe that's what it was. And now we're in a hospital. I'm sure there's nothing bad in here, and I'm sure that Nemesis is totally dead. Although I did notice when I looked back at the recording earlier... Whoa. That Nemesis' body after that gate closed... ...was gone. So Tyrell, where's Bard now? Gotta be the lab in the back. Stay frosty, I'm on my way. Copy. I'll go on ahead. Yeah, sure, I'll just lead the way. This guy always seems to just come later on and look at computers. Very helpful, my friend. Okay, uh, let's get everything in this area. Okie dokie, it looks like we're going through this door. There's nothing bad in here. Hello? I just need a vaccine. I think I heard Jill in the other room just now. That or it's a zombie. Oh, well, yeah, there is zombies. Oh, there we go, no surprises. How many zombies? And begs the question. Oh, that door's getting banged. There's probably going to be more zombies soon. What do I have? I have things. Okay, well, we're going to use the pistol, because we have the room here. There. Okay, there's a lot more than I thought. Okay, I think I just got that one up by shooting it. Okay. All right, we're just going to get you lads down a second. Okay, now I need a machine gun. Need a machine gun. Get down! Get down, motherfuckers! Sorry, you guys need to be on the ground. Okay, cool. Now we get to stabbing. Yeah. Flawless tactics. Flawless tactics. Even if you guys decide to get up later... Yeah, or, or just not die right now. There we go. You're missing a leg. Yeah, get fucked. Stay down. Stay dead. Should I be in a rush? Carlos seems like he's... He's screaming like he should be in a rush. Oh, hey. Cool. Right, stay down a sec. Okay, just hold still. Minor medical procedure here. I'm trying to get the zombie out of you. There we go, there we go. Right, uh, how about you? Yeah, you, you're you relatively undisturbed. Oh, speaking of, uh, undisturbed, there's a- Ah, no! Okay, that's- I need to work the legs. It's leg day, motherfucker. There we go. Oh, can you still walk? I'd rather you didn't. Just stay down. Ah, no, they can- Ah, they can still bite me! How did you get all the way up here? You've got no legs. Okay, you've got a leg, sorry. I don't know if I'm being ableist here, but... Right. Well, I'm not feeling very good. Good job I got all this health. And I got more health, cool. Okay, let's leave before any more of these zombies get up. Maybe I should be just shooting them in the head, but the leg thing seems like it's a good idea. I don't know, I was watching videos for Resident Evil 2 after I completed the game, and that seemed to be like what everybody was doing. I don't know why. There's probably a lot more to it than just trying to get them to stop. It's probably just a tactic for getting... oh. Past them. Okay. So, Jill's got the pick lockpick, so... She'll presumably be awake then? That's good. It's good to know that I actually do manage to get the vaccine then, that's good. Oh, there's a box out there. Um, right. Hello? 
No. No zombies. It's like it's a lot of distance to walk with no zombies. I'm getting concerned. Hello, I heard something behind me. Oh, I, uh, there's this guy. I thought I heard a thump behind me. Hello, I am armed. Please don't scare me. Uh, killing zombies taking names. Does that count? Okay, probably not. Zombie exterminatus man here. Uh, should I speak into this or is that a bad idea? Let's have a look. Let's have a try. Dr. Bard, are you in there? I'm here to rescue you. Open the door. No voice match found. Voice Fine. Match. What kind of sci-fi bullshit is this? Okay, nurse's journal. Oh, in Raccoon City. That's probably going to be good. Every day they bring in more of these mystery illness patients. The sedatives don't stop their delirium, so we have to put them in straitjackets and move them to the isolation wing. The problem is the isolation wing is already bursting at the seams. The director has ordered us to admit anyone with symptoms free of charge. But what does he expect us to do? Wish them better? We don't have a cure. And that's not all that's bothering me. When these patients die, they are not collected by the usual mortuary teams. We've been told it's special handling to prevent the illness from spreading, but I'm not sure I buy it. Miranda saw some guys wheeling a body through the forbidden door during the night. Why? Where? What's going on? So is this the forbidden door? It seems rather forbidden, unless you have the right voice, so I would say that's pretty forbidden. Okay, so a lot of blood here. Probably a good sign. I just stood on some glass and... I stood in some glass, I heard the music do the thing when the zombies are alerted and now I'm hearing banging. Okay, there's... them. Hello? Oh, hey guys. Okay, there's quite a few of you. Whoop. You seem a little stunned. Oh, hey. Okay, okay. Let's just work the legs. Okay, knifey time. Yeah, yeah. Stay away, stay away, stay away, stay away, stay away. Just gonna. Get a, yeah, no, you're not dead. I knew you weren't dead. I'm gonna just keep working it. Keep working the zombie. Alright, here you go. A little bit of a, an incision here. A little incision here. 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 No, still haven't got the zombie out yet. Hold on. I'll be with you in a second, sir. Okay, right. Oh, you're up. Go of all ammo. Let's just quickly work our way over this thing. Ah, you bastard! Oh my god, you tricked me with that crate. Fucking game. Okay, your legs are your legs are forfeit. Okay, right. Eh. Don't have a lot of ammo, so you know I'm gonna have to do this for a little while. Just stay down. I'm surprised you haven't came through that window yet. Yeah, no, you're still up. Okay, cool. Right. Uh, anything here for me? Assault rifle ammo? Yes, please. A green herb. I have a red. So we can combine. Don't think I need to heal quite yet. I think I can take one more hit. Okay, no zombies getting up. We need a key card. Okay. A lot of things we need. We need a voice, we need the correct voice, and we also need a keycard. I probably need to heal, but we're not going to do that yet, because I think I can take another hit. At least I fucking hope I can. Okay, there's a teddy. Cool. Not spooky at all. Yeah, not spooky at all. Okay, let's go left. I think we've probably got to go the other way, because it looked a lot spookier. 
But this way it might have stuff. Okay. Can I not? Hmm. I cannot open the door and Carlos is very grumpy about it. I do not blame him. Okay, we're not doing good. We definitely need ammo. Uh, I, I, judging by looking at the map just now, I've probably walked past some. So that's fine. Oh hey, <laughs> that happened. The music cue for that happened whilst I was in the <laughs> inventory. So that was a little awkward. <laughs> okay, are you gonna get up? No, you're just a mangled corpse. Okay, why are you falling now of all times? Did somebody throw you down here? I wonder. I don't have any liquors in here. I am not ready for that right now. As you can clearly tell. Oh, there's a lot of blood. There's a lot more blood than there was downstairs. I am immediately concerned. Claw marks on the walls. I think there may be a liquor here somewhere. I have a sneaking suspicion. Yeah. Okay, well, this is the door we need. Okay, hey, my dude. Uh, yeah, you're totally not gonna get up. Fuck you. 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 Ah, no, 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 don't bite me. Ah, I've had enough biting today. Ah, I am now. Now I need to heal. There we go. See, I'm fine. I should probably do something about his legs. Oh, Jesus. Okay, yeah, no. The leg thing definitely needs to happen. Fuck your legs. Fuck you. Now we work away. You're not dead. You're not dead. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Okay, he is dead. Okay, it's fine. Right. Not good. Uh, no items here for me to miss, so it's fine. <laughs> I should probably keep checking the map as I'm going through here. Because I'm very good at missing stuff, apparently. Apparently items in this big area. Yeah, probably. It is a big area. Okay. Uh, eeny, meeny, meeny, meeny. This way. I don't know. <laughs> it's... Uh, let's, let's just go a direction. Instinct says in here. Wow! Great instinct! Oh, thank you, instinct. <laughs> cool. I like my instinct. It worked really well today. What's this? Another nurse's journal. Admitted over 20 mystery illness patients. Patients in the isolation wing exhibiting severe limb necrosis, fever, Muttering delirium and signs of hyperphagia. Possible infection? Tried to have every anti antiseptic. Still no blood work back from the research ring. Ask again. Dr. Young was bitten while treating one of the patients. We've disinfected the wound, but his fever won't go down. Nothing works. Meanwhile, the outpatient wing is complete anarchy. The patients are delirious and growing more violent by the minute. We've called in our off-duty staff. It's all hands on deck now, but we've got to contain this chaos. Eww, eww. It's not going well, was it? Well, it clearly didn't go very well, did it? Uh, okay. Shaven? Shaven? Do I want to take anything out? <laughs> at the rate I'm going, probably... Yeah, at the rate I'm going with this, probably that. Now, actually... I have a tape player. I just realised I have a tape player. I could probably use that for... Maybe playing a voice? Cool. Right, good. Where's this fucking liquor? I know there's a goddamn liquor in here. I'm just kind of curious where it is right now. Definitely a liquor in here. Oh, def- in here? I mean, look at that. Trademark uh, liquor signs is the three scratches. Nice big roof. A uh, nice bloody room. Uh, do I have any grenades? I mean, they're my favourite liquor, you know, murdering thing. Good god, this is a fucking really bloody room. 
Oh my goodness, what the fuck? This is a very bloody room. Frankly, there's a bit too much blood. It's making me a little bit uncomfortable. Yeah, I mean, what else could make these giant fucking claw marks and everything? Okay, well, there's a lot of dead guys in here. Okay, we better test these. Good. We good. Um... Like, by, like, by all accounts, in terms of, like, Resident Evil enemies, Lickers aren't, like, top tier or anything. They are killable. It's something about them just freaks me the fuck out. I, and I have heard people in the past say they look kind of goofy and weird and they're just such a departure from just the normal zombie, but... I don't know, something about them just freaks me out. I don't know. Uh, ID cards are not to be taken off hospital grounds under any circumstances. As per our security measures, all employees must store their ID card in their own personal lockers. Okay. Um, so there might be an ID card. The key to the locker room has gone missing. The last person to have it may have dropped it in the, somewhere in the courtyard, so I need to go to the courtyard. So that I can get in here, and I can get a key card. Okay, is there any items here I could use? Maybe. Oh! That can be opened by... Yeah, Jill. Alright, well... We'll head our way back. There is... Sheer liquor somewhere. There's a glass roof is here as well. Oh my god, it's gonna come busting through the fucking roof, isn't it? Question is when? Uh, okay. Right, anywho. We need to go to the courtyard somehow. Probably this way. And we need a key to the personal lockers. And then we should get an ID card in there, which will open that... Oh, that door back downstairs. They needed that a card of some sort. Okay. Gotta say, very spooky hospital. Clearly a lot of mad shit happened in here. Okay, something banging on the doors over there. Is this like a reception? Looks like a reception. A lot of dead guys in here. Uh, this guy worries me. Okay, no, we're good. I'm just curious when they're gonna bust through. Oh, both... Both doors are banging. Oh, it's gonna get busy when I go around this corner, I bet. Oh, that needs an ID card. So you know what? Until I get that ID card, I'm gonna just come back later. <laughs> Maybe I'll find some ammo somewhere else, because I kinda need it. Oh, and that's how I get to the courtyard. Okay, um... I just want to check there's not anywhere else I can go first. Like, hey, yes, he like, like here, where the ammo is, this is also drop downable. Uh, can I open this? No. But there is what looks like a crawl space. I mean, let's have a look. Okay, not this way. <laughs> okay, do you know what, Carlos? I respect the sensible nature <laughs> of the... I respect how sensible you are, sorry. That was... You know what? Yeah. Let, let Jill do that later. Oh, saying that, you probably should have, like, rolled or some, a bit better or something, I don't know. I don't know the best way to land off of a fall like that, but I don't know if that was it. Oh, did I just... Oh, I just found the key. Oh, yeah. Well, that wasn't so bad. Wait, does that mean there's something over there as well? There is. I don't know what- Oh! If I jump over there, I could have just climbed over. Oh. Interesting. Oh, damn, I should have really jumped out a different window. Oh, I could have jumped out there as well. What the hell? I jumped out the exact one I probably shouldn't have. How do I- How do I do these things? Missing out on all this extra stuff. Okay, well, never mind. Uh, should I go back? I kind of feel like I probably should, but... Oh, hey! I 
I don't know if that's... Wait, where am I now? I think I know where I am. Yeah, below the stairs. Okay, so... We are getting there. Uh, I'm just wondering if I maybe should go back out to the court area and get that stuff. Probably a good idea. But remember... Oh. What are you doing? What are you doing, game? i seen that. i seen you saving. What are you doing? What's happening? What's, what's about to happen? You're making me paranoid. You're making me paranoid as fuck. <laughs> We're just saving. Stop it. Okay. We on the roof? Uh, I, I thought I heard something. Cha. Are you still dead, my friend? Yeah, good. Alright. Thank you for your cooperation. I'm gonna move on there. If I drop down here, I think I can get maybe whatever extra stuff is there. Let's have a look. If there is anything, uh, you would hope so. Yeah, there is. Totally worth it. Okay, uh, sorry, I'm just really bad at navigating this right now. Okay, totally worth it. Right, cool. We've got an upgrade. Upgrades are very good. Now, there's something over there. And we have to be over there. But then you would have to crawl underneath that bit. Unless it's in that room with the key card. Okay, so I think from here, I think what we need to do is... Get to that big scary room where the personal lockers are to get ID card. Where there's totally not going to be a liquor going to try to murder me. Oh, I just got a map of the hospital. Oh. Well, that would have been handy earlier. Okay, right. Uh, is this the... Yes, it is! Cool, okay. Sure nothing bad here will happen. Brace yourself, folks. Okay. I am actually quite nervous. I mean, once I see him, I'll be okay. Him, it, they, I don't know, fucking whatever. The fucking disgusting big monster called a liquor that I don't like. Eesh. Okay, we've gotten to the locker, so somewhere in here there should be an ID card. And then we're gonna enjoy whatever fucking banner awaits us when we leave this room. Oh hey, flashbang. I wonder why the game's giving me that. Sorry, I'm like ruining all build up here, but I'm ah! Oh god, damn it. <laughs> well at least I picked it up in this order and I can now relax with the game paused before shit inevitably kicks off! Oh god. You look like a zombie. And you smell like one, two. I mean you it's just a corpse, though. Okay. All right. Well, uh, I'm hoping that relief that relieves a lot of tension. That little jump scare. So uh, let's have a look out the side this door. I don't want to go around this way because I reckon there's probably at least a item here. Okay. Hopefully you guys aren't getting up. You know what? Let's keep the flash handy. Like a sensible boy, just walk around with a primed flash grenade in my hand. Um, we tried, I swear to god, we tried. No, we did. Um, but there's nothing else to be done. The chaos is completely beyond our control. The victims are pouring in now, dying and spreading the infection faster than we can reach them. So we've given up trying. Those of us who are infected have barricaded ourselves in here. We can hear the cries for help outside. The screaming, but none of us will go out there because it would be the end of us. I can't believe we've abandoned our patients. It's the worst sin imaginable for a nurse. I can't stop shaking, but I want to live. I want to live. Oh, God. 9pm, we heard a helicopter flying overhead and immediately started crying and hugging each other, thinking our rescue team was on the way. But then the sound grew distant and all we're left now is with the moaning of the dead and the silent screams in our hearts. We're all about to lose our minds. Dr. Young, Arianda, Miranda, Dakota, I am so sorry I failed you. Something's coming. Help. The minute I heard something coming, I 
don't know if I'd write it down. I would just stop writing. <laughs> but okay. Um, that was probably the Licorino. I had to guess. Uh, yeah, we need the um, the pick, the pick, the pick, the pick. Okay, right. But Jill has that. Okay. I reckon it's gonna happen here, folks. Come on. I am ready for you. I've got you figured out, game. Uh. Hmm. Oh! Not exactly when I thought it was gonna happen. And actually... Whoa! Holy shit. Okay, you know what? It's not liquor. I don't know what it is. I don't like it. Man, all this build up, I'm actually sort of disappointed it's not the liquor. Ah! Oh hey, uh, no thanks. Ah, okay, I flashed myself. Um, shoot it, I guess. I don't know. I'm gonna just keep shooting the shit out of it. You look like you're gonna be fast. You look like you're gonna be fast. Ah. Oh. Eat shit. I don't know why I did, but eat it. And I'm dead. Uh, right. So they one hit kill you, I guess. Huh. Shall we try run? I I, I kind of feel like trying run. I don't know. Maybe it might work. Run, run. Okay, we can maybe get around him. Maybe. Hey 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 hey! Run! <laughs> oh, he's really fast. Oh no, he's got big claws. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Run! We'll be fine in the safe room, it's okay. <laughs> Holy shit, I don't know what that thing is, I don't like it. Okay. Yeah, we have a new issue. Oh! <laughs> we have a key card now, I guess. So I guess we can go... Well, I can either run directly down to... The, I think the floor below, there was... Yeah, we're somewhere here that needed a key card, and there's a key card needed in here. I might as well have a look at it if we can. So that thing's in there. Maybe I'm good. Maybe I'm good. I don't know, I, I'm, I'm pretty certain that thing's gonna get out again. I don't really know what to do about it, so I guess we just avoid it for now. I probably shouldn't have used that flash in such a silly, goofy way, but oh well. Here we are. In the current circumstances. Ah, here we go. The tape of Mr. B, his research assistant took it. One of my patients saw Abbott remove something from a locker in the nurse's station and walk towards a treatment room. I'll try to sneak in and look during the night shift. You just have to stay cool and keep doing your job. Treatment room. Okay, we need to go to the treatment room. Uh, the treatment room. Oh, it's actually where we're currently going. Works for me. Hey, guys. Uh... Oh, that's a zombie. But I walked over you and you didn't attack me. Hmm. Oh, hey, everybody. Right, uh, I'm waiting for this guy to come around first before I start, you know, doing the stabby stabbies. Okay, no, no, okay now all of you are just making me really uncomfortable, so I'm just gonna go. Okay, I know this is not smart, but it feels very good. Okay, right, back to sensible work. Sensible medical procedures happening. Give me a minute. You guys can feel free to just cut away for a second while I do this. No, no, no big boy, you stay down. Okay, we're good, I think. Good as we can be. Load up. 
Okay, so apparently there's something even worse than the liquor in here now, which is good to know. Uh, let's see if this room holds any nice things. We could... Wait a minute. Don't need that. Get rid of that. Fuck that. Use one of those, because I am a little hurt. Okay, well, that's just beyond obvious. Thank you. And you also suspicious. Okay, never mind. Alright, let's deal with you. Cool. Carlos was a butcher in a past life. Okay. Or just a knife man. Good man who was good with knives, yes. <laughs> Proper profession. <laughs> anyway, okay, so both those doors go to the same room, so... Moving on. Uh, anything in here? No, not allowed in there. Okay, fine. There is a safe I noticed, but I don't know what the code is, so unless I do know and I just forgot... Do not think that is the case. Okay. Thought I heard a noise just now. Just hoping that thing isn't like, you know, wandering around the halls looking for me. Well, it, it, let's be real, it is. I don't know if we can kill it. I'd just rather not try right now. Okay, eh. Uh, hmm. Oh my fucking goodness, what the hell. There's two of them. There's fucking two of them in there. Apparently that's where the thing I need is, is in here. What do I do about that? I don't know how to kill them, or if I can kill them. They remind me of, um... What is it from Fallout? Death Claws. Yeah, they're like Death Claws. But obviously, well, I don't know. I don't know what would have came first. The Fallout games or the Resident Evil games that did this? I don't know. I don't know who did this monster first. These things are the death laws in Fallout. I do not know. Who won that race? Who got there first? Who inspired who? Please let me know down in the comments. Uh, ah! Oh god, why did that scare me? I heard it and I knew it was going to be there, but then I still got scared. <laughs> okay, well you might as well come through here. There's a lot more room to, you know, be doing stuff, so... Hey! Cool. Thank you. Just, just, now, just, just don't... Na 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 na, na 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 na, na na na, you stay. Cool, alright. Any more in here? Anything else I gotta deal with? Yeah? Ammo, that's good. Locker, Jill can open that. Um, red herb, good, good. We should do our duties. I have a grenade. Maybe I can kill them with a grenade. Oh, hey. How's it going? Right, you know the drill. Is this a pro strat? I don't know if this is a pro strat. This is just something I'm doing now, I guess. It works for me. It is totally working for me, so I'm gonna keep doing it. Right, we have... you know what? Let's get both doors open. So, the thing we need is in there. Um, there's two of them in there. Um, I have a grenade. I guess we can see if it works. Oh, hi. Oh, hey. Uh, 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 ow. Are they killable? I... Th they are killable. Okay. You just need to not be hit by them. Okay. I don't know if that grenade got the other one. Probably not. Well... Saying that, the zombies get up. Okay, yeah, that is my concern. The zombies get up. There's nothing saying they can't get up as well, so let's just do what we need to do and get the fuck moving. Okay, that is to be combined with... Okay, we're now getting that door. 
There's also a key carded slot downstairs we can put into. And there's apparently an item in here and I'm... I should probably try and find it, but I'm very nervous to stay here for too long. There's... okay, there's definitely an item in here. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it moving. Okay, we're out, we're out. So now we need to just go out the hall, down the stairs, get to that door. I'm sure nothing bad will be through here. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay, that's one way to get away. <laughs> okay. He could probably jump down as well though, so I'm not going to count on, you know, fucking anything. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Right, right, I'm just trying to get my bearings because I don't actually know where I am. Uh, I think we go right. Yeah, I think we go right. Oh, there's even more he is! Fantastic. Okay, they're coming through! Let's just open this room. I don't know what's in here, but let's go in. Oh, hey, cool, 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 cool. Ooh, flash gren grenades! Now I feel suddenly a lot safer knowing that I can actually take those fucking things on. The grenades do the job on them anyway. We've been inundated with reports of lost items. If you find something and it is unclear who it belongs to, do not take it home. Please deposit it in the nurse station safe, which is back upstairs. The combination is nine clockwise, three counterclockwise. There's probably something really good up there, I bet. Probably. I'm just going to decide with myself if I want to bother going to get it. Uh, are you guys going to be coming in? There's quite a lot of you out there. I'd rather you came to me rather than me going up to that door and getting munched on immediately. Oh, um... My health's fine, so I might as well just leave that there. I've got lots of health. The health seems kind of pointless when there's monsters out there that can one-hit you. It's like, what's the point in health? At that point. Okay, whatever. Um... Hey guys, do you want to come in? There we go, there we go. Just bang away. There you are, there you are. Okay, we got one down. Got more coming through? Yeah, you, you do your thing, mate. Uh, I'm going to deal with your friends first. Okay. Okay, a lot of guys lying. Oh, hey. On the ground. This guy is not cooperating. Right, time to work. Alright, cool. <laughs> Come good. Ah, oh, my hand. Okay, a lot of stabbing. Right, uh, one thing for sure. I would rather have... This one. First goddamn thing out of these big weird toad... Do you know what they do you know what they remind me of? I just realized. It's Resident Evil Battle Toads. So apparently we're fighting battle toads right now. Which is good. Now, here's the question. Do I wanna go back upstairs and grab this? I know of at least one fucking monster I have to fight the way back up there. I'm going to say no, because I'm ho we're going to be going through this area as Jill anyway. So maybe we can do it then. Yes. I'd rather do it as Jill. No rush, you know? <laughs> yeah, because there's even more things here for Jill to open, so... That's fine. Works for me. <laughs> I'm just a coward. Big, big coward. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Hello? Any, uh... Any problems down here? Anything I need to be worried about?
Okay. Uh... All I wanted to know was what the documents were doing in your office in the first place. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm goddamn Nathaniel Bard. I'm the best biologist you'll ever meet, you bedpan-changing waste of a nursing degree. Oh, he seems like an asshole. Okay, we made it into the room, which presumably has the cure for jail? Now we're gonna have to work our way back to her room, presuming she has been eaten by a battle toad. Uh, oh. Uh, is that the Nathaniel guy? Bard. Oh. Tyrell. Bard's dead. He's been shot. Shit. And the vaccine? I'm looking. Well, look harder. There's gotta be a computer, right? Someone who sh I have a sneaky suspicion I know who. Banquet invitation. It's my pleasure to cordially invite you, invite you to a banquet on September 10th at the Central Hotel where we will be exchanging viewpoints on Raccoon City New special medical zone. Attending will be Mayor Michael Warren, Chief of Police Brian Irons. Oh, that guy. Another distinguished member of the community. Thursday, September 10th, 1998, 6 p.m. The Orient Restaurant. And uh, the Central Hotel, second floor. We'd be honored if you join us. Sincerely, Greg Tester, United States Senator. Handwritten note. Nate, I will be introducing the bill for that new drug of yours in mid-August. Bring the cash. What the fuck? We've booked a suite for the usual after party. You're oh, you're you're a brunette guy, right? I'll let Irons know. Oh, I'm not. I'm feeling so bad about this dude being shot. All right. Well, question is, who shot him? It wasn't me. I probably might have if he was still alive. Um. Right. Guy had a shit attitude. It was a shit dude, apparently. Email from Nathaniel Bard to Greg Tester to reply immediately. I know you're watching the news. This virus is going to devour the whole country. The dead will wash over Capitol Hill like a tidal wave. You're not safe. However, you've always been a good friend to me, so I'd like to offer you a way out. I have in my possession one dose of a vaccine for the virus, the Holy Grail, and it's not for my family. Oh, shit. Not for my ladies on the side. No, Greg. I'm saving it for you. I don't think he's... Just got one. Like, why? This is like groundbreaking stuff. Why would you make just one? Hmm. <laughs> or maybe he's the only guy who could make it and he made one to give himself a way out. Yeah. You scratch my back, I scratch yours, which should just. Yeah, he's using it to get his way out. So maybe the knowledge of the cure died this with him. ERC Chief Nathaniel Bard, September 29, 11 p.m. Acutely aware that the time's running out. And I hope and pray by making this recording and bringing the truth to light that I can restore some small shred of honor to my name. All of Raccoon City's suffering began with the release of a biological weapon known as the T virus. My employer, the Umbrella Corporation, engineered this virus. And they ordered my team to develop a vaccine, which we did. Now, I keep samples of this vaccine here in my office. The rest of it is stored underground. Yeah, there's more. But those sons of bitches at the board, they want to destroy it. They don't want the world to know what they've done. So they're trying to erase all evidence that the virus ever existed. No, I'm not a fool. I know they don't want me to... And that's why he's dead. I got you only one along. And she trusted me anyway. Oh, he didn't know that Umbrella was dicks. Oh. Because he's working for Umbrella. Oh, he didn't know they're assholes. Oh. Is it here? Okay. Oh, yeah, I need room. Uh, uh oh. Oh, I can actually discard some of these. I'm, I'm stupid, I always miss that. Okay, yeah. We got the vaccine. Hang tight. 
Okay, how do we get back to her? Um. Right, yeah, so just out the door. Straight ahead. Sure nothing bad will happen. T, I got it. Good. I'm headed your way. Be careful. Careful? <laughs> Have you seen this town? It'll be a fucking miracle if I get there in one piece. Yeah, but have you seen the battlefield yet? They're kind of scary. And just the FYI. Okay, right. Oh, give me a minute. Oh, God. Okay, so they're not one hit, apparently. What the hell? That was a very weird interaction I just had. <laughs> okay, so they're not one hit. Uh, I don't know where the other grenade I threw went. Okay, great. That, <laughs> that was... Didn't go as bad as I would have thought it could have gone. It didn't go well. But, okay, they're not one hit kills, I guess. I don't know how why I died so quick that first time. Okay, right. We'll work our way back. Okay, we made it. We made it back. Surprisingly, nothing else happened. And now we can help Jill. There's still people in the city. You think Uncle Sam gives a shit? Yeah. Here they come. Oh, you sit tight. I got this. You better grab some gear. Sounds like there's a lot of them out there. Okay, where's the gear? You got some gear? Uh, I guess we got fight in our hands here. All righty. Well, you know, breaching clear rules. Just I'm try to lower what the my hell? Oh, I've just blocked the door. I'll try hacking into the hospital security system. Keep them off me in the meantime. Well, that's a lot of zombies. Detonator? Okay. Why would I need a detonator? Okay. There's maybe a reason why I need a detonator. I'm, uh, okay. Zombies, good. <laughs> Fire in a hole. Oh, is that zombie going towards that door? I think he is. Don't you dare. I need to guard that, I think. What the hell? Why are these exploding? Okay, the zombie bodies are exploding. That's weird. Okay, so I guess I don't shoot in the legs of this section, because they're just turning into little gore explosions. <laughs> Look, wait, wait, bleh. Okay, these are weird zombies. Bleh. Come on, do the, do the thing, do the thing. Oh, also items. Uh, okay. All right, let's switch to this pistol for a bit. Actually, getting a bit busy. Okay, so it's just like a little hold-off section, I guess. I like how they're just exploding. I guess it's to happen so there's not too many bodies in the area, I guess, but it's still kind of goofy. 
Especially the noise is very comical. It's like a cartoon. <laughs> it's very weirdly comical noise. I don't know how many shots I need. Okay, there we go. Uh, I really should be counting and checking, but then it just depends where you shoot them, I suppose. Boom! Oh! That's cool. Did the lights just go out? Oh god, yeah. I thought that was something I did. Yeah. Oh god, I uh, probably should have saved my flash grenades. Haha, <laughs> get punched, Battletoad! Ah, oh, no! Okay, uh, I'm getting... Uh, uh, okay, hold on. I've got plenty of health, don't you worry, my friend. Lots of it. Oh, hey. Give me a minute, give me a minute, give me a minute, Battletoad. Oh my god. Pa! Get punched! I love how he has a big super punch. <laughs> it's just kind of goofy, but I love it. Oh no, I'm getting a bit. I'm getting a bit mowed. I need to get. I think they're trying to break down the door. Yeah, they are. They're trying to break it down. I need to get over there. Oh no, this isn't good. This isn't good. This isn't good. Get away. Mega punch. Okay, there's a lot of zombies. I can see why they're exploding them all. There's a lot to deal with. Oh, you know, don't you do that. Don't you dare do that. You've got enough crap to deal with. That your head's doing that. Gotta say, starting to like Carlos, especially his giant punch. Okay, uh, oh, you're coming through. I need, I need stuff. I need stuff anywhere. Ammo, things, here we go. It's assault rifle ammo mainly that I'm quite liking. Okay, there you go. Huzzah! Is that? Oh, another one. Okay. Ow. Okay, I'm get. I'm get. Okay, yeah, you're winning. Congratulations. Eat that. Oh, I'm getting attacked from both sides. Ah, uh, and I'm dead. I don't know what that is, but they've got a move that just instant kills you. Uh, I don't know what that is. Ooh. Oh, this is going to be a tough section. I might need to take a break.